Hello, this is Sandy from A Good Life Homestead. Today I am making some split pea and ham soup. What I have done is soaked the split peas. They're dried and you get them in a bag. I soaked them in water overnight. You want to give probably about four inches above the peas with water because they will swell. And then I have a ham bone from a previous ham dinner that I stuck in the freezer for such an occasion. And now I have my homemade chicken bone broth. You can of course use store bought. That's about 14, eh, 16 ounces. Two and three quarter cups of water. Here I diced up two stalks of celery, two carrots, a medium onion, and I have two bay leaves. And I'm gonna put those in the pot. This is crock pot version. You will heat up your house. Those are all in there. Just stick them in the liquid. There. For seasonings, I have some black pepper. We like black pepper, so I go a little generous with that. And about a quarter teaspoon of rosemary. And oregano, same. Doesn't want to come out, so I'm just gonna pour it. There we go. Worcestershire sauce. I'm going to stir this and put it on high for six hours. And then if it's not thick enough, what you can do is take about a teaspoon of cornstarch and mix it with about a quarter cup of water, cold water. Mix it well, get all the clumps out, and then just stir it right in your soup at the end. And then let that heat up. I removed all the ham off the bone, and I did the cornstarch, one teaspoon with a quarter cup of water, shook it up in a jar, poured it right in, Stirred it up and it has one hour left to cook and it's already getting to the thickness I like. This is Sandy from A Good Life Homestead. Thank you for joining me in the kitchen and I'll see you next time. Please like and click on that bell for future notifications of videos that just downloaded. Bye.